Hi, I'm Sean from Garmin. In this video, we're going to look at the basics of using a Garmin heart rate monitor. Garmin's heart rate monitors can be used with many of our running and cycling products, along with select outdoor handhelds for instant feedback on how hard you're working. The first thing you'll want to do is adjust the strap size. Move the slide adjusters as necessary to make the strap longer or shorter. The strap should fit snug on the body, making good skin contact just below the breastplate. It should not be able to slide down on its own, but should not be so tight that it's hard to breathe. If your heart rate monitor has a detachable module, snap it onto the front of the strap, ensuring the Garmin logo on the module is in the same direction as the Garmin logo on the right of the strap. For proper operation, using regular tap water, wet the electrodes to create a strong connection between your chest and the transmitter. Newer straps also feature a contact patch to the left of the electrodes that should also be wetted. Not completing this process may result in your device not detecting or providing an accurate heart rate. After putting on the heart rate monitor, a connection between it and the Garmin device that the heart rate monitor has been paired with can be established when getting ready to start a new activity. If your heart rate monitor came in the box with your Garmin fitness device, then they are likely already paired together. If not, the owner's manual will have step-by-step -step pairing instructions that are unique to your device. Typically, the pairing process only needs to be completed once. However, there may be times when you will need to complete the pairing process again, such as a device reset, software update, or battery change. For best results, rinse and air dry your heart rate monitor after every use to avoid the buildup of sweat, salt, and dirt. For more information, including a complete heart rate monitor care guide, please visit the support section on Garmin.com, where you can also find a searchable list of FAQs and downloadable manuals along with information on registering your device.